Hi, um, I'm going to be doing a video on some new stuff that I just got uh, from Shani Cosmetics. So if you're interested in knowing what I use on my eyes, I'm going to go over that um, at the end after all of this stuff. Um, I purposely stopped without putting concealer and whatnot underneath my eyes because I wanted to use this like in front of you to show or so you could both see how good it is. My apologies, I am sick again. <laughs> I feel like every other video I'm saying I'm sick, but I've been doing really good this whole year. Well, it's barely the beginning of 2014, but I haven't been sick for about a year. I just don't do as many videos, so I haven't been able to see how well I've been doing. <laughs> okay, so for the first thing that I'm going to open and uh, dig into is the brush set here this huge massive brush set very fancy it comes in a very expensive feeling box that I kind of don't even want to throw away so that's what's in here the signature collection brush set 24 piece studio quality with a leatherette so it comes with like a, bl a brush roll. So let's open the box. Oh, there's goodies. There's some literature in here. Hmm. That is a plastic bag. Okay, so we've got this. Oh. I'm trying to be so careful. I don't want to drop anything on the floor. Wow, this is quite extensive. <laughs> So we go here, 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 do, 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 all the way to the end. That's a lot of brushes. Um, the first thing that caught my attention was this one here. It's got red on it. Red. That's pretty nifty. So here we go. Here's the big fan one. Super, super soft. This is also very soft. You can see me buffing my tinted moisturizer or beauty balm on with this. It does say buff, buff bronzer brush, so it does tell you what they're for. Slanted contour brush. I was going to use it for that anyway. Um, here's a powder, medium sized powder brush. Very, very, very soft. I am a fan. These are going straight into my little, I have this little thing from, um, what's that one place, Ikea, that it's like a big giant metal thing where I put all my brushes in, so these are going straight into those, so I could grab these to use. So these are some of the brushes that I cannot wait to get more familiar with. They're really nice. They look really fancy too. They feel really fancy. Oh, if you write a review online, you get a free brush cleaner. That's easy enough. I'm going to do that. Now, this is, I'm really excited about this. This is a huge box of uh, goodies for your face. The Mini Masterpiece Makeup Kit. So, let's open it together. It came in a little plastic thing, like the brushes, but I couldn't help myself, so I wanted to know how it opened. So it opens like so. And then it's got these little shelves, if you will. They pull out like that. I haven't opened them, but there. Here's a blush one. They're all individually wrapped in plastic. So here's another shelf full of concealer. You can see the corrective tone ones. 
We've got cream concealer. These are a bit bigger, also cream, so cream foundation. And we've got blush, more blush, powder foundation. It's good. Could probably contour with that. So you could do a lot with this, actually. Actually, you could be quite extensive with this if you so desired. This wouldn't be bad for a makeup uh, makeup kit, like for a makeup artist either. Oh, and these these look nice and shimmery and glowy. So these are like highlighty colors. I know the glare is pretty bad because of the plastic. I'm going to be trying for the first time ever this one right here with one of the new brushes. So far, it's pretty creamy and... The coverage is nice. How's that? From this side to this side. You can definitely tell it's like brighter and like alive. I need that life because I'm still like pretty, pretty sick. And I don't feel very lively. Or I don't feel like I look very lively. I just feel like I look sick. Can't even close my mouth. I have like this constant like open mouth pout because I can't breathe. I'm taking one of the powders and setting my concealer. Then I'm going to go with that really cool contour, that red one, and try the darkest one here. Get my contour on. I think it's so cool that it's red. What is the story behind the red? So next I'm going to use one of the shimmery blushes here. I'm feeling peachy. This one. Try this one here. That's pretty much it for the face. Not bad for all of them in that box, huh? Man, my hair is pretty wild today. I like the concealer. I usually have uh, issues with it like creasing really quick under here, but it's not. So this is the Shani Mini Masterpiece Makeup Kit that I applied with the new brushes that I just got. Uh, I should do one of those uh, the product shots. When everyone looks really happy in their thumbnail with like the stuff in their hand and it's all like fanned out. Totally natural, nothing planned. They just so happen to grab the stuff. There. <laughs> That's funny. But no, these are cool. <laughs> Yay! I'll have links at the bottom of, or in the description box if you're interested and you want to check that stuff out. Um, I'm actually very interested to see what else they have. Okay, so like I said at the beginning of the video, I was going to say what I use for my eyes. Really simple stuff. Uh, for my eyebrows, I've used Cryolon Sea Green Gel Liner. And for the really simple eyeshadow, I used Urban Decay Naked. Basics eyeshadows from the, or no, it's from the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette. The little tiny baby one, I love this. For the bottom liner, like smudged everywhere, this is Urban Decay's 24-7 pencil in black velvet. And for my liquid liner, I used another new Urban Decay liner in Ink for Eyes Waterproof Precision Eye Pen. This is very nice. I'm super into this right now. Oh, I didn't do my mole revival. And then for the bottom, the little purple detail that you see, this is a Sephora collection liner in Fancy Violet. I believe it's called something else now, but the bottom lashes are called Precious Lashes from House of Lashes. This brand here. And the top lashes are Heartbreaker Lashes, also from Heart, um, House of Lashes. For my gloss, this is Armor Beauty Purple Rain. 
We need some more. Alrighty then, that is it. If you have any more questions or, yeah, uh, let me know. And I'll try to respond to you if I can. Hope this helped. Hope you like. Thanks for watching and subscribing if you have.